Happy to oblige, Mr. Delgado. There you go. My husband nearly lost his arm when that winch broke, ah. but... Why the party so last know. night, huh? So you obvious. See. He's in cheese the first time in a while. What a magnificent like match! Yeah, it takes a sophisticated palace to appreciate the combination of Excuse me. No. 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 Hey, you're that guy who got injured, right? No. Hey, didn't lady. expect to see you back. Trying to make a phone call. I heal quickly. Off, pues muy bien. It's nice to see you again. Hey, andate la mierda. And about again. So you finally installed the limiter on the engine. About time, if you ask me. But it's installed now. The only way to crank the engine up that high again is to remove the limiter. <laughs> and nobody can be foolish enough to do that. That Delgado guy really likes his toys to go fast, doesn't he? But it's a kissy. I guess it. Well, I wish Delgado would just calm down a little. Did you see him sneaking around down here earlier? Well, the sub project is So the engine limiter has been reinstalled and fitted as requested. Yes, he just Don't want the repeat of your accident, verdad? He told me to make sure we erase Right. That would be terrible. Thanks for the tip. Make sure we do that then. What's the situation here? Is my baby ready to get her feet wet or what? There she is. What a beautiful thing to behold, huh? I don't think that I have ever in my life seen anything as gorgeous as this, honestly. This, this people is a real game changer. Good to see you. Well, well, well. Look who's back on his feet again. Good to finally meet you in person. I guess the accident wasn't that serious after all. I've caused worse, Mr. Delgado. <laughs> I like your style. <laughs> but enough screwing around. Get that engine pouring. I want to see how much power this baby holds. I'll do my best, Mr. Delgado. All right, my friend. You made this boat spacious enough to hold... what? Ten tons of cargo? We have increased the cargo capacity of the submersible to the required specifications, Mr. Delgado. So, theoretically speaking, how many armed men could we ship around in this thing? On top of all the drugs we'd be exporting worldwide? Around six, sir. Ten tons of pure white and six soldiers. <laughs> 
That is truly something else. It's like a submersible party bus, sir. Ah, the sound of that engine running. Smooth like a hummingbird. But you know what? I want to hear this mountain lion roar, my friend. Give him more power. Yes, sir. What's the range increase? Will we be able to go anywhere now? As long as you're traveling by water, yes. Yeah, is that some sort of engineering joke? I suppose so, yes. <laughs> but don't quit your day job. If you say so, Mr. Delgado. Now, finally, the engines. It is of the utmost importance that this sub goes as fast as possible. I can definitely say this is the fastest submarine I have ever worked on. Oh, yeah? Prove it. Certainly, Mr. Delgado. Now, Mr. Delgado is dead. I, I'm not assuming any responsibility for this. I, I told them after the accident, it's too dangerous. I said, I said, that hoist will never support something that powerful. But no, 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 they didn't want to listen. They didn't want to listen. Perdón, amigo, but... Are you on drugs? 